gets to discriminate. Yeah. And where would it stop? What if it was a Jewish wedding? Okay, I, I, no, no, bear with me. And the floor said, I don't want to participate in that kind of religious system. I would now, find another hey, florist happily. <laughs> yeah, okay. But once we set that kind of precedence, where will it end? And, and I think, you know, in the... With them going out of business. Because <laughs> everybody will find another florist. That's yeah, where it will end. No, that, that, that's all cute. That's all cute. That's not cute. That's, that's real. No, no. Why no do you, the, it's, it's, the lunch it's, counter protests cute, against... No, uh, the lunch counter protests that are so famous ben, in the civil rights movement occurred as a voluntary boycott in the early 60s, long before the civil rights movement, and it integrated. They integrated the business because of that. Capitalism is, ha, discriminates against no color, no creed, and no sexuality. They want the cash. Integration was done by force. Yeah. By against force. against state Many governments. Died and most over whites talk, did not want dude, to Dude, you, you live black. a very comfortable life. If yeah, you're going to yeah, talk yeah, about yeah, civil yeah. rights, so, you know, let's I, talk about what happened no. for people trying to get Jeez, served. Against, so against, let's, let's, let's so, make okay. sure we're hearing against one another. Against state just, governments just second, that were ben, compelling segregation. One, one second, Ben. Let's make sure we're hearing each other. What was it that, Ben, you concluded with? It was... It was it was Woolworths. That was voluntarily... It was state governments. Yeah, well, well, what I was saying point. there is that state governments were the source of, of segregation in the first place. Government, people who think that Jim Crow was a voluntary system in which people just decided that they wanted to segregate their businesses are incorrect. There were Jim Crow laws on the books. The law in the state of Alabama is that you needed a seven foot high wall in your restaurant. Okay, this idea that, that the government always has clean hands and that it's individuals who are the problem and that capitalism in the absence of government compulsion is not the solution to discrimination have, must have missed the last 50 odd years of, of history in this country. Let's have the re Reverend, you had something. Did, I mean, I, wanna, I think, I, you, you know, ben, add to that? No. The, the, the enormous inequality in our economic system is in part because of your divine term, freedom. And to think that... <laughs> And, and, okay, hey, bear with me. Do you think that freedom is always the answer? It's always the answer, isn't it? Yes. Hold up. I, I would like to... Read history, folks. I would Why like do you believe that government compulsion is always the answer? Read history. Well, <laughs> you, you turn... Okay, Ben, I, this, this is great. I, I should use your trick. Because government is always the problem. It Pretty is always much. the problem. Pretty much. Frankly, friend, Jefferson created the possibility of a constitution that allowed for your religious liberties. That is not the problem. My religious liberties and the founders believed this were secured by the government was created on behalf of for God. For the sake of your freedom. It, it was your for freedom. the sake of my freedom, but it doesn't and get to curtail my freedom. And government guarantees it. And if we don't have policemen, firemen, it would be chaos. Of course that's true. But the minute that the government infringes on my freedom, it becomes irrelevant and it becomes unconstitutional. And, it, and this is... Jefferson didn't just institute a government. He rebelled against one. 